guys, it's Shani, and today we're gonna be watching all of the Shavier moments. Oh God. Yes, I'm ready to tell my side of the story because sometimes it look a little awkward or like boy crazy, but I promise there's a reason why. I am sweating. girls knew I had a crush on Xavier, like I told them, but I always said, oh, he's cute, he's aight. Hi, how are you? Xavier was on the phone. And then Javier gave me like the, like to talk to him, and oh my gosh, his voice. His voice back in the day was like. Bye, Xavier, I'll talk to you some other time. Okay. No, you won't. You no. won't. <laughs> to get back at them, I'm gonna just like go with it, you know? I'm gonna like pretend, you know, get laughs and giggles. But then it got like really serious <laughs> to the point where like he actually messaged me. He actually followed me on Instagram. I'm like, oh, hi, how are you? <laughs> Okay guys, this is the dress shop. We're getting ready to pick out our dresses. <laughs> guys, meet my brother. Weak knees, weak knees. <laughs> I was, when I tell you my knees were weak, they were so weak. Like, they were really weak. I was so nervous, my elbows are actually. <laughs> Don't hide. He doesn't bite, I promise. <laughs> Iram just walked in with her brother and I decided to Hide in the corner because everyone's bugging me. But yeah, I, 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 I get a little nervous sometimes, but yeah. I was really nervous. Like, I was so down to hide in the corner the whole time. Oh, hey, let's get I'll go over here. over here. Yeah. Xavier, you can take a seat right there. <clears throat> can I right you? here. Stand <laughs> up. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh my God. He was definitely nervous too. You could tell, like, he was gonna like, he was nervous and I was nervous. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It was my birthday, or it was like a two days before my birthday, something like that, and he got me balloons. <laughs> I got, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I got in so much trouble for kissing Xavier on the cheek. I got chewed up by my dad, chewed up by my mom, and chewed up by my sister. After that, after that whole situation, he brought me flowers, remember? He brought me flowers. And I was like, oh my gosh, he's really down. Hey, Xavier, can I talk to you for a second? We're watching Life After Quince season one, where the whole thing blew up my face. Hi. Uh, <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. I like your shoes, by the way. I was so nervous, yeah, I, mean, I didn't want to ask him out. <laughs> Not in front of everyone, at least. Oh I want to ask him in private. <laughs> Do you kind of want to like go on a go out or like on a date or like hang out. As Isn't it supposed to be the other way around? So I was like, oh crap, like in front of everyone. But he said yes. I love to. Really? Yeah. I'm nervous now because it's cringe, bro. It's so embarrassing. Like look at, look how we look like. He has a ponytail. I have on this crazy green lipstick. I can go. Really? Yeah. Okay, cool. Sounds like a plan. Everyone was really excited that I asked Xavier out because it was like female empowerment. Everyone know, knows me as that. So everyone was like, yes, yeah, Shani, taking the first step. So, how you been? I've been great. I got That's good. He said yes to the date and now we're watching the date. Oh my gosh. I don't, okay, this, this episode, I don't like watching it because it's really awkward. I like your car though, it's nice. Thank you. I'm not gonna lie here, in the video, it shows us having a good time. The real day, I was super awkward. I didn't know how to act. He's just a conceited person. He's always been like that. And I didn't know at the time, so I was just like, oh, this is not cute. Like, no, you're rude. That picnic was so awkward, bro. Wanna make a toast? Oh my gosh, okay. <laughs> For a really fun day today. Okay. Uh... And first spending time with you. Yay! I'm a good time. I am a good time. You just didn't know it at the time. So what are your plans like in the future? Um, like after high school or well, what do you want to be? Watching this picnic scene, it is really awkward, but it's just really cool seeing like, we were super young at the time. We had like big dreams, goals. I'm one of the lucky ones and got to achieve my goals and dreams. One, two, three. 
I think I think he ended up keeping one of the photos because I had two selfie photos of us, and he kept the cute one, and I kept the ugly one. So yeah, I wonder if he still has it. What if he like threw it away? <laughs> I want to thank you for today. It was fun. Wait, pause it. I want to talk about it. <laughs> oh my God. We were supposed to kiss like on the lips, but I've never had my first kiss, so it was like really. I looked at him like, um, it's just a kiss to you because you've kissed so many girls. And then he just like walked away from me. And now I kind of regret it. <laughs> Not kissing him. <laughs> Woo! Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah. yeah. That was awkward. Like even Irem, Silali, Alyssa, they all felt the awkwardness. Shoulder. One. Two. This scene, my ankle was really twisted like really bad. No. Ooh. Right, good job. When I fell on Xavier, he, like he hit me in a way that it hurt my leg, and I was like, "Oh my god, like this freaking hurts." It was so weird. I would have loved to be a date though. Like that would have been fun. I really wanted, I really wanted something to happen with me and Xavier, but it didn't. I'm not gonna like risk it. Like honestly, if that makes sense. Like I felt like I'm not gonna risk what I have with someone else for Xavier. I would have loved to be a date though, like that would have been fun. Just go and take pictures and everything. Would have been cool, I guess. Why did he have to say that? Like, why'd you have to say that? You're so freaking late. That's why I was mad. That's why I said what I said. Here. It's a bit too late, isn't it? She's like, it is late. Like, you had all this time. You had two seasons <laughs> and a reunion. <laughs> like honestly one of my favorite seasons this trip San Diego and Mexico coming into this weekend and going to San Diego and coming to Mexico um, I don't know like when we had that little talk in the car I felt the connection at the end like hey we're close again or hey we're cool again you know we're not hating each other anymore we're not blocking each other on snapchat that's why I like this season so much we all got a little humbled down this was cool. This was honestly one of my favorite moments, scenes, because I got to tell him how I actually felt, and he didn't get mad at me, and he was actually really nice to me, and didn't come after my wig. It's a good way to end the summer, huh? Yeah. Yeah, it's been a roller coaster. Ugh, that dress is so cute. You know, Xavier, I really did like you. Like, legit. After this moment, we got to be like cool I guess you could say like it was still obviously awkward because I make everything awkward but he joked around with me more he was treating me like a human being so that was cool you made me cry bro a lot you made me feel bad about myself and the fact that you didn't tell me anything made me feel even worse it made me feel not good enough to be honest you could have told me something I wasn't expecting to get in a relationship with him. I just wanted to have a friendship or a something, you know? Not to hate each other, because we have to see each other all the time, you know? I was dreaming, I was dreaming, love. So. Then we were sleeping, I was dreaming, love. <laughs> he whispered, I still care for you. Still don't know what that means. <laughs> Still don't know what he meant by that. There was a stillness in the air that night. Everyone loved that. Even my parents loved that like little moment we had. It was crazy. Feel the weight of the world. Why did you do that? Oh my gosh. I don't have anything to say to that scene. Only that like, why did you do what you did? And why after that you pulled up with Raquel? Like I don't understand. Blonde Shemi. Hey. Hey. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Pretty good. It's good. I hate that I'm taller than him. Me and Xavier are the same height, but my hair is obviously bigger. So I look taller and the fact that I wear heels, I even look taller. So sometimes in photos, I have to bend down a little or I have to like go a little down. I think you can kind of tell in this scene. What about John? John? Your boy. Yeah, no, that, that ended a while ago. Actually in San Diego, 
Is that right? Mm -hmm. And it's true. It did end in San Diego because of Xavier. <laughs> John was really jealous of Xavier. Even when I told him like nothing's gonna happen, nothing's gonna happen in Mexico, he called me screaming like, what are you doing with Xavier? I'm like, nothing's happening with Xavier. What am I doing with Xavier? Nothing's happening. He didn't believe me, so I'm like, bye. We just wanted to congratulate you. Thank you. So you that I'm proud of this whole thing and what you accomplished. Aw, he was so nice to me that day. Even though he was being a little weird, he was nice. <laughs> I was so nervous when I tell you. And then his mom, let me tell you, his mom texted me the day before asking what I'm aware so she can have Xavier match me. Like, it was so funny. I thought you stood me up. Nah. You look good, though. Is that right? <laughs> you want to take pictures? Yeah, sure. Good, yeah. We kind of, we just look like, honestly, we look cool. We look like friends. Yeah. Are we done? Okay, a lot of people did comment this. It looks like Shannon and Xavier were holding hands. Yes, I did hold his hand on accident. Because, you know what? I don't know why. I, I have no explanation. I held his hand. I felt like holding his hand, and that's what happened. I don't see a problem with that. Bye. <laughs> I'm sweating after watching all of that. It was too much cringe. When I found out like Xavier is like dead, I cried. Cause I'm like, me liking Xavier started this whole thing. It just makes me sad, you know, seeing it end. I cried so hard. I was like hiccuping, it was crazy. I don't think I'm ever gonna move past Xavier just because he was such a big part of my life. He's gonna have a special place in my heart, you know? And every time I see him, it's like the emotions like, reverse you know i'm never gonna get over xavier but i'm excited to start my life without xavier so, yeah. all right guys thank you so much for watching comment down below what you guys want me to watch next click the boxes down below to watch more videos and don't forget to subscribe to awesomeness tv bye